Yeah, I'm driving. It's time for the bottom line. So, Alyssa Milano is in Atlanta. The last day that uh, Congress is in session. And gives her spiel about how movie industry needs to pull out of Georgia. Brian Kemp signs the heartbeat bill and whatnot there. So, number one, if you pull everyone out of it of Georgia for the from the movie industry, how many people are you going to put out of a job? Now, I'm not talking about the actors. I'm not talking about the directors and producers. I'm talking about people that are behind the scenes, the roadies, uh, the, the key grips, uh, things of that nature, the lighting uh, people, every, everybody that's behind the scenes. So you're going to eliminate their job uh, because most of them are local uh, in the area. So that's point number one. Great job. Way to go, Miss Milano. Way to, way to stand behind your, uh, your fellow Americans. Uh, number two. So, the abortion. Now, an abortion is essentially murdering a... I don't, I don't want to use the word individual, but it would be murdering a living creature because it does have... Well, in this case, after six weeks, if a heartbeat is detected which in this case, but we've got other states that will do it even after birth. Um, so we're talking about murdering children. That's, I mean, that's the bottom line. That's all you can call it, is murdering children. It's not aborting. Aborting is a fancy name for murder. Bottom. That's the bottom line. Um, so... The big thing is when when my brothers came home from Vietnam, and I say my brothers because they were they they did the same thing I did. They they put their name on the on the line and they served our country. Uh, so as a veteran, I consider them my brothers. Um, when they came home from Vietnam, people spit on them. People threw things at them and they called them baby killer because they had to kill children that were trying to kill them as suicide bombers but they were called baby killers and now it's okay to, to just walk into a, a Planned Parenthood or an abortion clinic and and just kill a, a kill a baby murder a baby but you're not a baby killer Wow okay so I've said it before, and I'll say it again. Live by the way of the Bible and the way of God, and you won't have to worry about getting an abortion. If you are married, you are having sex with someone you are married to. If you're, you know what, and even on top of that, Use, if you're gonna have premarital sex, use a condom. Use protection. Don't get pregnant. But it all goes back to doing God's will and living God's way. That is the bottom line. Because if you do that, you will never have to worry about getting pregnant. That's the bottom line. I'm out.